Hey guys, we're out. We're out here today to show you some seed saving, and we're going to be looking at onions. So first, I'm going to go show you some first-year onions over here. Now, onions are a unique type of vegetable. They're a biennial. This is after one year of growing here. You can see the onions sticking out. Now you have the option of harvest, harvesting them this year or just harvesting half and leaving some of the smaller ones set. And if you, so let's get back to the biennial. Biennial means this plant needs two years to fully mature. Uh, but for farmers, in the first year they mostly harvest the crop. But if you're a permaculture gardener, you're gonna to wanna to let some onions sit for the second year and so that they do this, which is seed. You can even see the seeds in the pods right now about to fall out, and we're gonna show you how to get those in a second. Look at that. But the biennial plant uh, itself, there's flowering plants, foxglove and uh, hollyhocks are biennial. And as far as vegetables, you've got radishes down here, biennial. These are gigantic radishes, um, which we're gonna roast some, but take a look at this. That looks like a daikon. And so if I leave some of these radishes in the ground this year, next year they'll get a stalk and a uh, seed. So those include radishes, cabbage, beets, and onions. Now onions, which genus and species is Allium sepa. The sepa, the species, is where the, is the Latin root for saboya in Spanish language. Uh, but all those allium flowers and hybrids that you, like the giant alliums in your garden, if you have a perennial garden, they're just onions. Did you know that, Leah? I did. Oh. So we're going to now show you how simple it is to seed save these. Right before they're ready, for, they get this awesome white flower here, and then it'll start to get a little old. And then once it gets a little bit brown here, you can come test it. And all you do is um, get a container like she has. And then you can just shake one over a thing. If you see seeds, well, then it's ready. <laughs> and then you can be a little more aggressive. You can, like, totally get in there. And think about what's happening here. One onion has now made... Thousands. <laughs> thousands of seeds. Yeah, she's just getting started. Oh, and they smell delicious, too. Well, Does that's it? the cutoff point. Is it like an onion? Yeah, it smells like onion. And you can even eat these stalks if you want. I mean, it's just like an aged onion, but heck, in a survival situation. Ooh. Ooh. Be that gentle. That was a jackpot. Yeah, gentle. In a survival situation, um, think of how much food is in that second year stalk here. It's huge. That thing is huge. It's going to make for some great compost. But here's the second thing, uh, while she seed saves, because we're going to show you how many seeds you can save in a few seconds here. Guess what you get? in a two-year onion. You also get an onion. Yeah. <laughs> Isn't that amazing? It might not be the fanciest onion you've ever seen, but that's an onion. And some of the nicer ones uh, will store for months because these have been grown for years. And these are just gonna be some nice red onions, single serving for a salad or whatever we're cooking. So you don't lose the onion. In some regions you're going to. There'll be some rot and you'll get a central core that's looking a little different than the second year growth. But the onion, I mean, after you cut it, you can just take out the bad parts and use the good parts. So she's back here seed saving. Uh, we got four heads. Look at this. This is like $20 worth of seed from um, a seed company. And that's not even all the seeds. No. Some of them are still in there. Yeah. So that's just what's shaking off easily. Yeah, this this is like one of the better pods, drier ones. Yeah. But these could dry even a little bit more. And the only thing you risk to letting these dry a little more is onions falling to the ground and regrowing. But I also <laughs> don't see why you couldn't just let this continue to dry after you've cut it off and harvest the rest of the seeds later when they're ready to easily shake off. <laughs> yeah, and if you were actually doing this and seed saving, what I would recommend is to come and take these heads off and, and lay them in the sun. Mm -hmm. you lay them in the sun for two or three days, make sure it doesn't rain, and then seed save. Because these things will be dry and super ready and you'll get all of the seed. 
So I hope you got something out of the video. It's easy to seed save onions. And these alliums can be eaten in the first year. You can save some for the next year. And just one single <laughs> onion makes a lot of seeds. Look at that. And it also makes onions. <laughs> Subscribe to the channel, share this with like-minded people, and make onions. Happy onions!